what does it mean for something to be open source and what are the pros and cons for you there? Hey everyone, Alex Moen here with today's BizTech Tips. And open source, it almost always refers to software. And open source software is essentially where the code's available. And not only can you study it and see it, you can usually uh, change it and do anything else there. And oftentimes even distribute the software uh, in any way that the user wants to. So it's usually a free or low cost license and it's developed by a community um, for professionals there. And usually the professionals are just doing it like a hobby, like it's not paid there for them too. So some of the pros there, I mean, it brings diverse talent, right? People from all over outside of one company, I mean, multiple countries and backgrounds even, they get to scrutinize and add their ideas to the mix. And usually that results in, you know, different bug fixes and really high quality products there also. And, uh, but again, there are some negative sides too. So since it's not done with a company with a budget, I mean, there's no marketing to get quality engineers to validate every single little thing necessarily. There might be lots of projects out there not getting people or time as a result. And it also, of course, I mean, when it comes to like customer support or tech support, that's almost non-existent. And usually these are a little bit less user friendly in general. Um, but uh, besides that, just the development process, um, I mean, since it's mostly hobbyists and things like that, it can be tough to coordinate or uh, have everybody have their pieces fit together there. So it takes that little extra bit of work there also. But again, different pros and cons. So it depends on you. The free or cheap user licenses uh, oftentimes offset those different cons there as well for lots of different instances. So do you use any open source software? Are you going to start looking for it now? Um, there's tons out there. Let me know down in the comments below. Uh, don't forget to like and uh, subscribe and have a good one.